गुड इवनिंग गुड इवनिंग गुड इवनिंग कैसे हो भाइयों कैसे हो उनकी बहनों हाउ यू डूइंग गाइस व्हाट्स अप तो आज हम डिस्कस करने वाले हैं बहुत ही ऑसम टॉपिक आज हमारे पास नया अपडेट आया नई हीरो भी आई है सो वी विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट व्हाट्स अप ब्लैक एंड व्हाइट हाउ यू डूइंग ब्रो वेलकम टू द स्ट्रीम माय ब्रो वेलकम 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 टू द स्ट्रीम गोना ज़ूम आउट अ लिटिल सो दैट यू कैन सी मी मोर क्लियरली All right today we are here to discuss about the new event that's happened we are getting a new hero as well as a new beta uh, arrangement has happened so we're going to check that out today and let me quickly fix the discord yep that is done and that should be done Yeah, I'll be making this bigger anyway, so don't worry about it. So that you can see exactly clearly what's happening, what's not happening, etc. So we will be discussing exactly. Yes, Terry is good. Uh, no doubt about that. Size Terry, बहुत अच्छी है. उसको मैं पूरी डिटेल में अभी समझाऊंगा कैसे खेला जाता है Terry को, क्या किया जाता है Terry के साथ. और क्या करेंगे उससे पहले हम फटाफट आज के एजेंडा जो पैच नोट्स आए थे उसको देख लेते हैं सो क्विकली लेट्स गो टू द डिस्कॉर्ड स्क्रीन शेट और राइट एंड द फर्स्ट थिंग ऑफ द एजेंडा इज बेसिकली योर टूडे ट्वेंटी सेवेंथ विच इज अक्टूबर ट्वेंटी सेवेंथ दिस ऑफिशियल सर्वर विल नॉट बी टेकन ऑफलाइन मतलब तेरे को ऑफलाइन जाके अपडेट नहीं करने वाले हैं योर सर्वर आज इसको आज ऑटोमेटिकली ऑनलाइन ही सब कुछ हो जाएगा आपको सिर्फ एक छोटा सा अपडेट दिखाया जाएगा वो भी मैं गेम स्टार्ट करने के टाइम पे कितना एम है वगैरह सब दिखाऊंगा ओके उसके अलावा सिर्फ एक टाइटन का बैलेंस हुआ है क्रिकनाक का बैलेंस हुआ है क्रिकनाक जो है हमारे जंगलर है अच्छे खासे जंगलर है कॉकरोच हमारे और उन्होंने सोचा था कि असैसिन जो है कैंटेकोली टैंकी टाइटन्स मतलब असैसिन जो है वो टैंकी टाइटन्स ले सकता है लेट स्टेज ऑफ द गेम हाउ ओवर इज एस वन विद एन एसेंशियल स्किल ऑफ इज यील्ड मैजिक डैमेज ऑन परसेंट रेंडरिंग अनएबल टू रिसीव द फिजिकल डैमेज बोनस फ्रॉम मुरामासा ड्यूरिंग द लेट स्टेज ऑफ द गेम उनका जो एस वन होता है वो सिर्फ टैंक को लेने के लिए काबिल नहीं होता बट उसका जो एस होता है उसको मैजिक डैमेज भी आता है परसेंटेज के हिसाब से क्रिकनेक जो है मैजिक डैमेज देता है तो उनको क्या होता है जब जब तुम मुरामासा बनाते हो क्रिकनेक के ऊपर तो उनका थोड़ा सा डैमेज लेट गेम के अंदर कम हो गया है उसको उन्होंने ऑप्टिमाइज किया है और बताया है कि एस वन मार्क्स डैमेज एस वन मार्क डैमेज सेवन परसेंट ऑफ मैक्स एनिमी एच पी एंड एक्स्ट्रा वन परसेंट एडिड फॉर एवरी फिफ्टी पॉइंट ऑफ फिजिकल अटैक फिजिकल अटैक अटैक अगर तुमने बनाया है तो उनका एक परसेंट एक्स्ट्रा तो आठ परसेंट टोटल मिल सकता है तुमको एनिमी अटैक पे एस वन उसका जो है कछुआ छोड़ देता है और उसको डैमेज देता है फिजिकल डैमेज इक्वल्स टू एट परसेंट ऑफ एनिमी मैच एक्सपी एंड एक्स्ट्रा वन डे से अगर तुम्हारे पास फिजिकल डैमेज ज्यादा है ये आरकेना पे भी डिपेंड होता है तो आठ एक्स्ट्रा डैमेज आता है तो वो क्रिकनेक के ऊपर भारी होता है ठीक है नेक्स्ट है नई टाइटन टेरी आने वाली है विसाय जो हार्ड बोलते हैं टेरी जो है एक अतरंगी टाइटन है वो उसका जो जैसे लावेल का एरो मारता है ना वैसे लावेल का एरो जाता है और स्टन कर देता है टेरी ऐसा डैमेज नहीं करती टेरी का जो है एरो जाता है उसके जो डूल उसके चक्रास होते हैं दो चक्रा या ड्रम बोल लो वो ड्रम ऐसे एक दूम एक दूम एक दूम फिर के जाके जो विजिबिलिटी देती है विजिबिलिटी देखता है एक और दूसरा उसको थोड़ा सा हल्का सा डैमेज दे वापस आता है वो है टेरी मैं उसकी पूरी डिटेल्स अभी थोड़ी देर में समझाऊंगा टेरी वॉज बॉर्न इन द पेयर ऑफ स्टार आईज एंड स्पेशल इमोशनल कलर परसेप्शन एबिलिटी शी होप्स टू यूज हर स्पेशल एबिलिटी टू परसेप्शन एबिलिटी शी होप्स टू यूज हर स्पेशल एबिलिटी टू हेल्प मोर पीपल फाइंड आउट मोर अबाउट टेली एंड हर काइंड हार्ट उसके अलावा बग फिक्सेस एंड इंप्रूवमेंट्स है फिक्स्ड अ बग दैट कॉजेस सुपर आर्मर ऑफ आओई सुपर आर्मर मिलता है एओई को उसका स्किल एस टू टू बी इन इफेक्टिव फिक्स्ड अ बग दैट कॉजेस मार्क फ्रॉम फेनिक्स स्किल वन टू बी अनेबल टू रिफ्रेश द कूल डाउन ऑफ स्किल एस टू फिक्स्ड अ बग दैट कॉजेस साउंड इफेक्ट वुड बी हर्ड इन द टारगेट इन द डायरेक्शन डिस्टेंस व्हेन ग्राक वाज रिलीजिंग एस टू फिक्स्ड अ बग दैट कॉजेस साउंड इफेक्ट कुड बी हर्ड बाय टारगेट इन डिस्टेंस व्हेन मगांगा वाज रिलीजिंग एस टू Fix the abnormal feature behavior when editing the email in settings in the game. तो ये सारे एक ईमेल साउंड इफेक्ट्स के दो ग्रैक का और मगांगा का 
एस टू जब मारता है तो डिस्टेंस से आवाज़ आती है ये फिक्स किया है और फेनिक का स्किल एस वन का कूल डाउन एस टू जब कूल डाउन रिप्लेस होता है उसका एस टू का फिक्स किया है और आओई का एस टू इन इफेक्टिव होता था जब वो सुपर एम यूज कर में होती थी ये सारी चीज़ें उसकी फिक्स हुई हैं चलो आगे चलते हैं आप गेम में और देखते हैं टेरी क्या चीज है लेट्स गो एंड प्ले सम क्लैश ऑफ टाइटन ये देखा 11 एमबी का अपडेट आया है 11.4 पॉइंट एमबी का अपडेट आया है सो दैट यू कैन डाउनलोड द अपडेट व्हेन यू वांट टू इट्स ओनली 11.4 पॉइंट फोर एम बी यू डोंट हैव टू गो ऑफलाइन उसका सर्वर ऑफलाइन नहीं किया गया है 11 एमबी का अपडेट के बाद यू आर फ्री टू प्ले वट एवर यू वॉन्ट टू प्ले ऑल राइट वी हैव ऑलरेडी टेरी आई थिंक थोड़े से डाउनलोड और भी आए होंगे गेम के अंदर लेट्स गो एंड चेक दम आउट There the balance titan resources are being downloaded. Let's just wait for it to download approximately 9.66 plus 20. That's 29, 30 MB, 30, 32 MB, uh, 32 and 35, 36. Lelo, 36 plus 2.5 is around 37.5, uh, 37, 38.5, 38.567, 38.567 plus 24. Uh, approximately, kariban kariban, tum lelo. 36, 54, 52, 56, 56 7. Approximately ले लो तुम करीबन करीबन एक जीबी से कम ही है सौ एम बी सौ एम बी तक फिर से डाउनलोड आ जाएगा ऑल राइट ये वेटिंग चल रही है ये खत्म होता है आर्केड मोर रिसोर्सेज डाउनलोड हो रहे हैं नॉर्मल कार्निवल डाउनलोड रहा है एक्सपेंशन रिसोर्सेज हो रहे हैं डाउनलोड ये एक्सपेंशन रिसोर्सेज लैंग्वेज एक्सपेंशन रिसोर्सेज है हिंदी लैंग्वेज हो गया ये सब लैंग्वेज हो गया सो वो सारे होते हैं बेस पब्लिक रिसोर्सेज भी डाउनलोड गए सारे रिसोर्सेज डाउनलोड गए आई गेस यस अराउंड सौ एम बी सो इलेवन हंड्रेड पॉइंट सौ एम बी डाउनलोड होता है हेलो गुड इवनिंग अभिजीत वेलकम 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 वी आर डिस्कसिंग द न्यू अपडेट वी जस्ट कम्पलीटेड डिस्कसिंग द न्यू अपडेट एंड नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू गो एंड चेक आउट वॉट तेरी इज ऑल अबाउट सो लेट्स गो एंड टेक तेरी टेरी शी इज नोन एज टेरी ऑल राइट सो लाई लेट्स गो एंड चेक आउट टेरीज गुड फीचर्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट्स गो एंड चेक आउट टेरीज स्टफ विच इज द टाइटन She is in marksman. She is a marksman altogether in Terry. So, what are our features? Uh, let's see. So, skins. Let's see. First, Terry's skins. Two skins are there. Second skin is this. So, should we play with the new skin? No, right? Not right now. I don't have the other thing to buy the skin. But we can buy the skin, and we'll do that later. Uh, let's see. 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 Steve is the agent of the Eye Light. Terry is a special agent of Veda of Eye Light. She, as opposed to using her abilities, Terry. Uh, I will tell you. I will tell you, Abhijit. Slowly. Terry is a special agent of Veda of Eye of Light. As opposed to using her abilities, Terry prefers other side to confide in her out of her own accord. She is a reserved kind of character, so she wants other people to talk to her. Whenever Terry is free, she returns to her adoptive parents and trained to be a priestess. Terry will sometimes join in missions uh, with the light chasers, but not as an agent. So light chasers in the sense, Dirac ho gaya and uh, Tulan ho gaya. If I'm not wrong, he's a light chaser. No, uh, the one with the Veda side of things, they go with Terry very well. As in, uh, she they're very uh, compatible, and Terry is able to see emotional colors of certain people like that of Illumia. Uh, she was born in a poor family, lived in free federation. Despite being the youngest child in the family, she was shunned by her parents and neighbors for her innate pair of starry eyes. उसके आंखें चमकती हैं, stars जैसी होती हैं, and empathetic abilities. Only her siblings were able to take care of her. Yet her biological parents sold her to a married couple who yearned for a child for their own and resided in the kingdom of Oka. Under the meticulous care of her adoptive parents, Terry grew up carefree. And during her visit to the kingdom, Loreal de- discovered the talent Terry and brought her ab- back to Veda and made it her into an agent. 
Now Terry, a chaser of the light, is actively taking on missions in Athanor and doing whatever she can to help others walk out of the darkness. So the teacher answer was L'Oreal. We just leveled that and we've got a synergy. Yes. Uh, best bud would be uh, Lavelle if I'm not wrong because Lavelle is part of either Yon or Lavelle. We don't know yet. Anecdote. What is the mysterious mysterious power of Terry? Reach tier 3 with her to find out. And what do you want to uh, what do you want to learn more about Terry life? Of course, reach tier 4. So we need to reach. First of all, let's go and check out her in trial mode. Let us go and check out what all distance that she needs. What all the uh, S1, S2, S3 do. Alright, I'm not going to upgrade her. Let's see exactly how Terry is played in these roles. So we will go with the first one, which is Terry fires bullets towards maximum targets of 5 players within range. The bullet deals 275 damage and plus 91 physical damage. That obviously increases through this thing. Until units are marked will be slowed by 30% for her S1. So unit ko mark karna padta hai. Dekhte hai kya karti hai. Kaise karte hai. So there is... She slowed down for 30% for the time being. You see... See, she, the thing was slowed down. That's how it done. That's, you, that's how you grew it. And then you slow him down again. And you can activate my S2. Though I'm playing in the middle lane, you should see the damage she does and the kind of this thing. So let's see what her S2 does. So you can clearly see that. Oh, this is what her S2 does. It opens a chain reaction portal to her starts to her uh, activities and this thing just like a lavel would open up to this thing uh, open up for her s1 for his s1 that's what this does chain reaction portal goes and comes back like a seesaw all right let's go and check her out in the jungle a little bit does she able to do some damage basically slow kar deti hai terry and that's a good thing for terry and when you are attacking something and it's targeted s1 and s2 was this thing hi Sayan, how you doing how's your how's your uh, arm bro better so we have an ultimate now ultimate terry ka bohat, bohat majedar cheez hai. so first of all the combo first combo for terry would be you do s1 then s2 to damage see s1 and S2 to damage. Okay. I missed that combo there. But anyway, now you see what happens is if this is the Terry of the of the this thing. Suppose now Terry, you you think that the uh, the jungler is jungling is blue. So you go, let it go, and that thing will hit the edge of the uh map and come back and bring it back to Terry. That is the plus point of Terry. See all them, all of them are targeted. Basically you have to get a target on her and then you can quickly, quickly, quickly in succession. Oh, missed him. He's going to recall over there. Maybe I can try and get into it, but no, let it be. Obviously, I'm going to try um, playing this with on a 1v1 on a bot game with a marksman 1v1 first before we go ahead and use her in the actual game. So that's what Terry does. The On a regular account, she's just like any other marksman, just do her normal attacks. And after the game, we will go and check her build out. She is a general, generally like a Veda build, to be honest. The slow doesn't really cancel. So now Thane is running away. Okay, let me just check out what the ult does. It's come back. There we go. Now 
Maybe I can take this tower down. No, let us just. Okay, she gets movement speed as well when she's on a rest too. Late game Terry will be really, really, really uh, damaging. Right now we're just trying to capture this tower and take them down. Maybe we can take this tower. Yes, we took the team tower down. We will not play rank today for just checking out what Terry is all about. Any marksman need a, needs a lot of gold to handle. There we go. That's the beauty of Terry's ultimate. It goes and comes back. Anybody in that situation, you have a 5v ganging. And... It will go and come back. So something like a lifestyle build on Terry would be really, really, really worthwhile. I guess uh, Terry's mana is also a problem like Talanus might cause an issue later on. So it's nice to have an enemy blue buff if you can. Or you make in the you can make uh, an item which is the mana item, which without a fail, you will get keep developing mana. It's in the magic build. I will show you which item I'm talking about. But for now, let me just jungle a little bit so that I've got the blue and I can recharge my mana without a problem. All right. So let me try and get the combo. He's charged and I can damage, 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 damage. Yes, I got him. Did you see the distance that Terry can damage? That's the that's one of the reasons why Terry is so good in the marksman as a marksman. She's almost like a Hayate distance. You see that big circle she can form. Maybe she might get nerfed later because of the kind of distance that she can take at this thing. Damage. She can damage. There you see how I was able to, how I'm able to. That is return boomerang. Slow him down, slow him down, slow him down, get him. Oh, missed by feathers, missed by feathers. Yes, got him. The Almost, 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 almost the combo was missing. Yes, I've got the combo right. And there we go. Another kill. Now, they, you see the herd lifesteal also is acting up. Oh man, the damage to the towers is unbelievable. Do you see that range? Terry is able to guide the. There, I you, I've got life steal as well as every minion I get is a life steal. So Terry's life steal would be really, really effective if we make a life steal on her. There it will come back. Yes. Did you see that? Did you see that? The, the, the. It goes and comes back. That's the beauty of Terry. It's like a boomerang. It hits the edge of the planet or your map and it comes back into the, into your position. So anybody who's trying to run away from you, Terry's ultimate helps you get it down. That's great. Kriknak is buffed, not as such. Yes, he's been adjusted, to be honest. I think she needs Fafni plus blood, uh, Bloodthirsty Bow. Which is your... Uh, to kill um, uh, the... Um, so, let's just check her, check her equipment out. Let's go and check out her equipment. Where is Terry? Terry, 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 Where are you, Terry? Okay, I just clicked. Damn. All right. So I would technically sustain damage deal. 
I would change that and make it my build. Okay, the items I would make for her would, uh, I wouldn't go for uh, this thing. I would first make the clave sanity and second item I would go for would be, um, to be honest, a lifesteal, uh, which would be giving me added, it, it, you know, damage with this thing. Third item I would go with this. So I don't have to make a Mura Masa. Fourth item I would go just like she needs mana, right? So what would give us mana? Or actually I would recall for the mana. So fourth item I would make would be in the attack. I would go with the Fenris tooth. And the last item I would make this. It would be nice to make a slick string on her. Either go with the uh, soul detainer or go with the slick string. No, this item doesn't have a lifesteal. It decreases anybody's lifestyle on them. So soul prison on dealing damage reduces target HP regeneration of lifestyle. Generally, uh, other heroes, uh, you know, there are heroes in the game which definitely go for a lifestyle. So, uh, which go for a health regeneration. So it doesn't this thing. So I would want to go for a uh, regen cutter, which helps like, you know, with heroes like Crick, Knack, Ogya or uh, any other MM also on a region uh, on a region with uh, bloodthirsty or something i would i would go for that you can change your soul detainer for a slick string which would mean that you would get uh, reduces duration of negative control effects and decreases speed ups um, decrease movements i would go with slick string because it gives me extra critical hit and attack speed but you can even go for the uh, devil's handshake which would give me uh, my attack speed increases so that will be Awesome. Sir, will you kindly show me the best settings for tank? Of course, uh, Magician, uh, Mr. Cool. Uh, right now, I am. we are discussing about Terry and particularly about the new update that has come. So let me just complete that and then we will probably discuss about the tank. All right. So this is what I would go for Terry in terms of an attack. Uh, I would actually go with the slick strings. Uh, sorry, the uh, attack speed first, devil handshakes first. Uh, then Clave Santee and then to support that with the Fenris and either I go with the Fenris Tooth or I would go with the Fafni Stallion, either of the two. So uh, Fenris Tooth would deal 30% uh, additional damage when target HP is below 50. That will give me a late game advantage on the hero but if I do not want to just increase that I would go to the Fafnis which will deal additional physical damage. So I would rather go with the um, Talon. Alright. So, which will means like whenever I'm able to do it faster, it'll give me a physical damage equal to 8% of the target HP. She deals with physical damage. So, uh, let's go and check her actual this thing out. Enchantment, I'll just go with the Veda enchantment. The general Veda enchantment is, is basically all your, um, your uh, Sanctum of Light, Sanctum of Light, Sanctum of Light, definitely. And your Lokheim and your Lokheim will give you basically your attack damage for that. And I'll equip that. Cartoons, uh, the cartoons one is good to go. In the Arcana, I would go with Savage Reaper and Dragoon. I think that's good. There is a 16 plus lifesteal on this already. So that's why I was getting the lifesteal when I was hitting the minions. So if I did not have that, I would have a critical build or something, then I would get more critical damage, which means I would hit more. So this, this build is good for now. Later on, I might change it to uh, my second build, which would be a uh, critical hit build, which is this. Normal attack, critical chance, physical armor, pen penetration, and movement speed. I would go for this one. I would switch between the two in case uh, when I'm playing a rank game and... Right now, Cartoons is on the top build, so he goes with, uh, what is this? He's going with Armor Penetration, Movement Speed, Lifesteal is 1.6% and critical, critical Chance and Critical Rampage, Reaper, Fairy. So, I would probably go with his build, but the the issue with his build is he's 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 got only level 3, he's only shifting between uh, Fairy and Reaper, which is taking Lev's Lifesteal and this thing, but I would go with Full Lifesteal, which is my build which is Dragoon and Reaper, which is full lifesteal and critical chance. That's the difference between my build and real cartoons build at, at the moment. So, 
do we have lifestyle item in the same beast is a unique uh, lifestyle situation which we gives hi well, and good evening uh beast is a good lifestyle item you can switch between in case you you need more damage uh useless under terry blade of eternity is over i think we should use bloodthirsty bow i don't like see bloodthirsty bow is like a is like a normal attack critical chance and 10 percent lifestyle if you if you proc uh bloodthirst then you get so instead of uh, having uh, a bloodthirsty bow i would rather generally on a marksman it also depends on how you play i would rather uh, giving uh, going for the beast instead on the early build just instead of um, the so called devil's handshake i would go with the because she's on critical i go with slick string instead of a uh, the thing so i get attack speed as well as a critical chance extra uh bow is purely for an mm but on a pure mm kind of build so i don't want to, i don't like going for a bird blood thirsty bow unless i it's a very late game and i really need to proc so if they have a uh, single damage like a two, uh, like a quillin or a cricknack or a zephis or a, uh you know such kind of high attack physical attack kind of heroes then i go for a blood thirsty bow and i proc it and i damage a few things and i get my health back and that's when i use it it depends on how you play totally if you are good with blood thirsty bow then you should play for good blood thirsty bow otherwise you do not need blood thirsty bow according to me on an mm in case and until late game on a blade of eternity then go for blood thirsty bow after you finish using your blade of eternity all right anyway so i am going to go with this build at the moment um omniams gives you omniams is better on a jungler mm slick string we have made Fe you can choose between fenris and sig fenris give you 200 normal attack and whereas uh, fafnir's give you 60 normal attack that's the difference between fafnir's talon and fenris fenris give you 200 normal attack which means your normal will proc more damage it's a good thing to make uh fenris but you know they they unique passive the passive that they have is 30% damage when target is below so if if you are really starting to proc your fenris tooth on a uh, below 50% that's when it helps you more uh but late game is like anyway late yeah her this thing is good for fafnis of course but she because he's got attack speed so you will have like you have a, you already have slick string and you get another attack speed this thing so the um, the amount of number of this thing will get will get this thing oh happy birthday above heaven welcome happy birthday bro very very happy birthday above heaven good evening and happy birthday man all right so let's go on 1v1 practice let's go for a cpu match let's make it hard so that now we are playing against an mm all right with my build so we have fenic fenic is a really uh, strong uh, mm hero let's see how terry fares with the with the cpu fenic all right let's go let's go let's go Fenix is great in the jungler so if if uh, you have a fenix uh, coming in through and as a jungler do not try and engage him with fairy you will be disappointed with the the kind of damage he might not give out Oh man oh man oh man you saw that kind of so i would i would suggest to proc your um s2 first s1 first so that you get more slow down speed and always remember terry is always better to be uh procked s1 before s2 and it is better to proc there it will go all the way and come back and damage him all right i almost am able to start my slick string the slowdown is not that great on terry 
but you have to be careful about how much you can do it you see uh, i am got fairly enough power with against a fenic as well because i am i have not even proc to my s2 right now look at that look at that terry's there he goes down that's right that's right that's the power of terry that's the power of terry's s2 it is a boomerang one after the other and once you once i make my slick string you will come to know the difference between um uh, how much attack speed i have this is all attack speed what i'm playing right now you see how many how many shots i can hit on a normal basis look at that and i am totally taking him down here he gets double hits when my my s2 proc he slowed down maybe it might come back yes i got him I think Terry will definitely be adjusted after some time because she is got the spear the damage spear of Terry is way large is way larger than any marksman so maybe that's the benefit she has almost got him there again maybe this might help yes it's going to ricochet and come back but I was not able to take him down he is going to go heal himself I think I can finish this game. Yes. Before I got my slick string. All right, it's about time. Whenever you're playing a new hero, always 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 do this kind of a practice run so that you can uh definitely be in a better position when you actually play play a normal game. All right. Now we go to a normal game. Let's go check her out in a normal game. What Terry is all about. I am not sure whether I will be able to immediately get Terry on the first try but let us at least try and get her as soon as possible. Hi Kegington, good evening. Hi Amit, how are you doing? Played for like 3 hours in Asia server practice. Me hero. Me hero. Hi Don, what's up bro? Welcome to the stream. No, Amit is a she's a good hero, bro. Just ditched her after that. All right. Welcome above heaven. Happy birthday to you, man. On which update, Don? Uh HOK has not come yet. Please give me Terry 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 Come on come on I can do this I can do this quickly Mark Spen Terry Absolutely great good job Maybe uh, I don't know why maybe this round I might have to restart the game again so that the animations come in for Terry uh, but anyway Oh happy birthday Don happy birthday It's actually a friend's birthday today which is uh, above heaven Breathless uh, is birthday today and happy birthday don All right let's check her out maybe I buy her of course if if I find her good anyway Uh depends on how you play also right if you like playing her then uh, you might find a difference in her you know I wouldn't I wouldn't like shun her down so easily She has got uh in the past two games that we played we played with against Thane as well as played against Six so it's about her proccing her S2 properly and once you proc her S2 properly you can get definitely a good damage so let's just check her out um maybe we might do well might not do well compared to other FMs like Yon Slim's Brune she's not that good You never know bro like uh she might actually prove to be a better 
yeah don you are actually on uh, uh you are on facebook and these guys are on youtube but anyway the chats will come down below you can see there both facebook and this thing chats will be down below anyway let's go the thing is with terry you need to be uh, very very uh, a little bit farmed up think terry would be better with the crit damage in arcana yeah terry is good with the crit damage but she has a life steal option as well so it's better to give her a life steal option as well All right, two marksmen on my trail. Better to go home, or I can actually defend this. Hold on. Nope, couldn't defend it. Need to go back. Let's go back. Oh, you see that mark on top, which is two hits, zero hits. Hi, Mac. What's up? Yes, COT is alive and well. All games are alive and well. People are just got busy. That's why they don't play more often. But absolutely, every game is alive and well. If you go and check out global rankings, ninety percent of all games have been reduced. So don't worry about it. COT is definitely alive and well. I like how Terry's uh, hit strategy is. I wish I had my ult. Yes, there she goes. There, I will go and get Violet back. Yes, that's what I. That is the benefit of Terry. COD map has changed. Bilkul map, yes. COD map has changed. There we got, and we got the Slayer as well. Beautiful run by Doctor Strange. All right, I've got my first item. Maybe I can take down Tulin as well. Yes, I took down Tulin as well because I had the slow ability, which was S one. That is the beauty of Terry. That is definitely the beauty of Terry. Wow. Anyone who can do chases Terry and you can definitely take her down. So now you see I can Valheim. I can double hit him. Oh, missed him by inches. There I go.
Yeah. Thank you for that, Tulan. The stack still remain. That is awesome. Right now, I don't have any lifesteal. There I go against... GG! What about timing? I think I can do this. And... There I... It's going to go click him, click him and come back. Do the damage. There, that helped. Ha, ah, Ranbai is working on the tournament uh, Deadshot. He will be taking care of it soon. Uh, the COT community guys are uh, requesting for their own casters and also getting a production team in place for it. So, Ryan is working on it. Don't worry. We will soon have the tournament once all that is sorted out. Just wait and wait for it. So it'd be a good idea if I do live steal right now. Probably make a this thing, but it's okay. Uh, he's taking the slayer. Let's go and get the slayer first. But I'm definitely able to do. It's a seven zero. Got the slayer. The thing is, I don't want to die. Can I approach to kill? I have to do the combos quickly. Yes, I got them both. Brilliant double kill. I don't think I'll survive this. Oh, I didn't survive. Almost there. Almost got him. Oh damn! I if I if I wish I had the tank item, I would have got them both. But any which way, well played. Tournament आने से पहले map hack का issue तो fix कर ले cot. Nothing to worry about. Everything in due time. Everything in due course. It will be happening. Map hack issue is not only our uh, headache issue. It is a uh, 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 overall scenario issue, which means arena of Arena of Valor also has the map pack issue. <laughs> Once the ban situation is sorted, it will automatically trickle down to our server as well. Anyway, so there you go, guys. Uh, a full and all thorough Terry explanation. How to use the combos, what to do, how to space yourself for the damage to build up. Uh, a brilliant gameplay also. 0-7, this thing, MVP. Thank you so much for joining me. We will be coming right back. I will be restarting the server and we will continue gaming on COT. This is for today's, uh, just for the explanation of what we wanted to showcase. Uh, the I will just quickly, quickly, quickly run through what are the differences on the um, uh, update as well. Quickly, let me showcase that also. I have already done it in the start of the, start of the evening, but I will do it again. Um... Here you go. This is the current scenario when it comes to your uh, yeah. So this is the current Titan balance, Titan situation. 
Krikanak has been changed. He is getting S1 mark damage, which is the damage equals 7% of an enemy max HP and extra 1% added additional 50 points of physical attack. Physical damage that equals to 8% of the enemy max XP and extra 1% added for every 50% points of physical attack he had earlier had a problem late game he used uh, he can take on tanky titans at this late stage game however his s1 which is an essential skill of his yields magic damage on percentage rendering him unable to receive the physical damage bonus from muramasa during the late stage game so if a kriknak makes a muramasa he was earlier not able to yield any magic damage on percentage basis so his this thing has been now shifted from Earlier, I think it was 6%. Now it's been to 7% plus 1, which is 8%. And physical damage, which is 8% on enemies match XP. And an extra 1% added for every 50%, 50 points of physical attack. That's the only change. There are some bug fixes. You can go and check it out on the Discord channel. Thank you so much, guys. I'll be right back in a few messages. Take care. Good night. Peace out. I'll be right back soon for more.